Hi everybody. Um, I've got my toilet paper tubes again today because um, again it's just something that everybody has around the house. Um, and today we're going to do a little painting craft activity. Um, so I've got my paint but I also have some options if you don't have paint. You can even just do this with water and a towel um, or even water on a paper. It'll still make a mark. Or if you wanted to do get a little bit of color or something, if you have some washable markers but not paint, if you just chuck a washable marker in some water, it'll change your, your water color super quick and just kind of make it something a little more fun, a little bit more interesting. So what I'm talking about today with our um, painting craft activity is again, our simple vocalizations. We're gonna pair a little tiny word, a little tiny sound along with our action. And this is good for any kind of you know painting or just coloring or that kind of thing. Um, but when I am painting, I like to use words like dip, 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 and then we can go dot, dot, dot. Um, so another thing here, I'm going to use the girls for example here is our giving choices. So, um, Maeve, what color would you like? Would you like blue or black? Um, blue. Blue. Okay. There you go. So let's say she just pointed. So Maeve, I'm going to do it again. Do you want blue or black? Okay. If she just points, that's fine. If she doesn't need that word, give her a good model. Blue? Blue? Blue. Blue, there you go, good job. How about you, Molly, do you want black or pink? Pink. Pink, okay, there you go. Good job. All right, so girls, you're gonna do some painting, so you'll go dip, 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 and then dot, 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 dip, 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 dot, 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 dot. Dip, dip, dip. You could also maybe go wee, wee. Something like that. Wee, wee. If your kiddo is a little older and imitating more, you can kind of show, you can talk about circles. This one looks like a sun. Just talk about lots of vocabulary. You can talk about the different colors. Um, if they're working on some a little bit higher vocabulary, but if you're just trying to work on those simple sounds, dip, 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 dot, dot, dot. And if they're not at the point where they're imitating easily with words, then what we wanna look for is that they're imitating our action, that they might go like this, and then now they're gonna spread it back and forth like this instead. So I'll show you here too, you dip, dip, dip. We can do it with the water too, dot, dot. 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 We have to dip a lot here. Can I do it? Soak it. Sure, Molly. Mm -hmm. Dip. 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 It kind of shows up on the towel. Let's try it on a piece of paper, huh? You might just dip. have to get it really wet. Dip. Dip. It's working. Dip. 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 Did it work, me? <laughs> dot. Dot. It does work better on paper. Dot. 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 So you can use this activity for just copying actions, doing what I do. I'm gonna go in here, and then I'm gonna go in here. I'm gonna do dot, 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 or I'm gonna go wee, wee, wee. wee. Try to just get them to imitate that action, and then always pair that simple sound with it so they can work on those little itty bitty sounds. Or you can do something a little higher, like working on your, your shapes. Your colors, what does this shape look like? Another paper. That kind of thing. Okay, hope that's helpful. Hope everybody's doing well. Bye bye.